people of the YouTubes, uh, welcome back to my channel. My name is Wendy, if you're new here. I do videos on motherhood, lifestyle, um, travel, exercise, uh, fitness, as I was saying, exercise, fitness, and anything that I feel like telling you guys about. So if you're new to this channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button and hit that bell button to get notified anytime I post a video. So, thank you. Here's another video after going on hiatus for over a week. Um, my... I have so many ideas, so many ideas of videos and content to put out, but I'm getting that anxiety of posting. It's it's come back again and I don't know where it's come from. But we're beating it and we're doing it. Yes. So today we're going to do our my current favorite brands that I love right now that I'm using. Mostly Kenyan brands. If you know me on a personal level, you know I love Kenyan brands. Like I'm really big on Kenyan brands. May it be skincare, may it be clothes, whatever. I love Kenyan brands. But I'm not where I want to be when it comes to purchasing and um, having Kenyan brands. It also needs a bit of money. But what I have now is what I've been using. At least the first quarter of the year. And I hope to continue using and just keep adding more. I have so many things on my wish list. But yes, so let's get straight into the video. So today's video... It's going to be a new series. It's going to be called Wine Wineversations with Wendy. So that'll be the club. WWW. So Wineversations are conversations on having a bottle of wine. Today's wine is Samantha Wines. So I saw Samantha Wines on um, the Real Houses on Nairobi. And then I came and found a bottle at home. My mom's. So it's my mom's stash. So yeah, we'll um, use, we'll have this then i'll give i'm actually just learning how to drink and enjoy wine it's um something i just started recently and i'm starting to just really love and how to learn the culture behind it how to just you know taste and whatnot and find what exactly works for me and what doesn't yeah so and we were turning all in my cousins one but um okay my hands are a bit you need to just that skincare so I'm looking for something. Something. Yeah. My yo. Okay. Oh, finally. Yeah, so. Let's get it. translucent but not as much so it means it's aged a bit more i'm learning i took a, a class with my friends recently so we learned um how about times they're not they're not showing but yeah so i love it let me let me um It smells actually really good. It smells sweet. It's not so there's there's no acidity in the in the smell as in there. It's not strong in terms of smell. It's really sweet. It's like really sweet. My goodness. It's very sweet. I'd have this with my friends. I definitely have this with me. So let's get straight into the video. Let's get straight to the video. Um, um, oh, I didn't tell you it's called Castello de la Mor. It's a product of Spain. But it's by Samantha Wines. You guys know them for Samantha Bright. So let's get into the video. Um, so this month I've had um, not this month, this the beginning of this year till now, I've been big on skincare. Because um I've been being a skincare because cycling, swimming, and running. If you followed me on Instagram, you know that um, I cycle, I swim, and I run. So because of that, being exposed to 
the elements and, and, and you know just being outside the dust and everything can really mess up your skin i never really had skin problems like drying up and whatnot until i started training and being outside for long hours then I, my skin started peeling and drying up and i was like what so i needed to take care of my skin first so we'll start with skincare because it's one of my favorites so one of my favorite things to use is this um po care it's um it's sunscreen that uh i honestly don't know why my dad gets them because my dad buys them everyone in the house has this as in you never lack this in the house like oh, it, oh every bedroom and everything and it really work it works really well and doesn't leave a white cast this one i think he gets them from the supermarket or there's a specific pharmacy he buys them from i would ask him and then um he can give me a range but i've seen him moving slowly to um la roche the spray sunscreen but that's just for him i haven't used it this is what I'm using and I love it. I love it. So I think when we're done, we can just put them here. Um, something I am now obsessed with is this Nancia My Serum. Ooh. And um this facial moisturizer by La Luz. She's a Kenyan brand. Um, I just found them on Instagram. I remember seeing a post by them that really made me hooked onto that um page. They were saying you should just do skincare for your face. You should do it until your boobies. And I was like, nah, you're about doing it. I'm like, no, for real, for real. And think about it, yes, because when I'm swimming, I'm exposing this whole part outside. When I'm running, chances are high. When I'm not covered up fully, because I really struggle to cycle and run covered, like fully um, layered. So, I mean, when I feel heat, I just want to remove my clothes. I can't deal. So, this has really helped. They're really working. I just bought, I think that I only had them like a month. So I've, um, I'm using them a lot. I'm using them a lot. One of my favorite things about this moisturizer is it leaves a matte finish. It's not so glossy. I like glossy finishes once in a while. But when I'm like doing on my daily errands or even when I'm just about to go outside and cycle and do whatever, I prefer a matte finish. I don't want my face to shine too much. Like right now it's a bit glossy and shiny. I like it like this when I'm going to bed. Or when I'm going to like hang out with my friends and I'm not having makeup on, then I can do a, a really nice glossy finish and just yeah, that's what that 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 at that point I really like um that. So let's move to yeah, let's move to scents because I am obsessed. So I've had this Akinaisha, I feel like crying. I've had this for a minute. Dolce and Gabbana. It's called Shine by Dolce and Gabbana. It's called Dodge by Dosha Gabbana in my room. But I've had it for a while. And my dad is the one who bought it for me. Most of my scents, my dad is the one who buys them for me. And let me tell you, all of a sudden this year, I've just been obsessed with this particular scent. I never used to, it was not, it's not among my favorites. It's never been among my favorites. So I normally use it for like day to day. But this time, I just find myself pulling it out and just using it more than any other. So. Yeah, I don't know if you guys might like it. I believe he got it from Fragrance Lounge. Um, any of the branches. But mostly I think he gets from Galeria. The Hub, yeah, those ones. But, oh, I didn't finish skincare. Ooh, this is, this is, this is, this is everything for me. You see this? This, this. So I get this. I get like 20 of them. Yeah, I get like so many. I buy them from Jumia. <laughs> I get this from Jumia. It's those masks that come in bulk. And I get them for like, I'll get for like 1500 for like, is it? I'll confirm prices and put them down below in the description box. But I get them like less than 2 Gs for like 20 pieces, which I think is a steal. Because right now I'm on a budget. I'm on a budget. Economy in Panda, it's, things are expensive. So yeah, so I use them all, like, I alternate between this and um, other, uh, like, some masks by natural glam the turmeric mask so i'll turn it this one and that one and another mask i got from the supermarket just to try it out i think that time was blue and i was using my parents card so this much about it so yeah i decided to get it for myself and i really love them i really love them they work they're not messing up my skin so they're working for me right now um one of my favorites is this i had missed my compact powder from Pollen cosmetics I use mine in the shade Cocoa, 
Coco, Cocoa, <laughs> whichever. Um, it's full coverage and it's um, a compact powder and I'm obsessed. I'm obsessed with poly cosmetics. I use their lipsticks. I use their, their um, foundation. I use this compact powder. I'm obsessed. As in literally, I'm obsessed. I don't know if it's because it's a Kenyan brand. I also, um, I think, interacted with the owner at some point and I really loved them. But one thing about me, I am blessed about Kenyan brands. Even if it's not that good, I will always just give it more grace because I believe even the international brand started somewhere and with good criticism and always like just reaching out and telling them I think you should work on this, I think you can work on this. I think we can make Kenya great. <laughs> that is so toxic. But yeah, I think we can do better um, for our manufacturers and people who just come up with brands. I think we should. I, I'm a supporter of Kenyan brands and Pauline Cosmetics is one of my personal favorites. Anyway, so I was filming and then I realized Puna footage really but yeah, just in between. So we were at Rich Skin. <laughs> so Rich Beauty. So I love Rich Beauty so much. I got this in um, the shade Vam and I also got it in Nemo and I am very much obsessed <laughs> with this um, product. Uh, when I noticed Huda was back as Rich Beauty, they look in their town. I don't really like going to CBD, but this one I went for. And I also use their retinol serum. It's it's really working wonders for my skin. I am so happy. I love them. I think they're just a thousand bob. I can't. I think that was the price. Me, I'm really bad with memory. I don't I don't remember most of the things like yeah, like prices and whatnot. I easily forget. So let's go to hair care. For hair care, let me even just start with this one. So there's this. For hair care this is a headband by me my brand I make them myself I sell them for just 300 bob and they re they really come in handy when I have um, braids you know don't they have um, I just got this done the lines and braids so it's not that important or essential but when you don't like your hair coming to your face this is it when you're at home and um, when even you're going for an errand and your ages aren't late this is it when your hair is looking a bit rough rough because when my hair started chapai this is what I used to throw on every single day. And it matches with almost any dress or outfit because it has blue, the dark blue. It also has the light and the white and the nudish, pinkish color. I think if you really would love to support a sister, hit me up. I think I have like 10 pieces left. You could um, check my business page down here, House of Nudie, and then you could get yourself um, a piece and your child. Or you can get your child a piece. I don't know. Whoever. I even throw it on a wig when I've not like secured and I wanted to look, throw it on. This this is a candle that I made. It smells so good. I love it. It smells vanilla and strawberry. It's also up on my house of beauty shop. Um it's quite mild, so it smells um it burns a bit so that you can start feeling the um, scent, but it's really, really good. I really like it. I called it Timbuhila because my child is the sweetest girl. Um, the only difference between this one and the ones that I'm selling is um, the wick. I don't like the wooden wicks. I don't think they burn as well. I had to experiment to know. So as you see, I tell you, Aisha, because I've been using it so much. I'm obsessed. I am obsessed. Let's go to our hair care. Hair care. So, there's this dark and lovely waterless cleanser. It's one of my favorite things now. Because you see, us girls of um, working out, us girls of um, fitness, and always being outside sweaty, this is it. This is it. You don't need to wash your hair every day. You don't need to, um, yeah, you just need to use this waterless cleanser. Let it clean out the dry parts of your hair. Like if it's, your hair is um, drying up and whatnot use this clean your hair it feels so cool so clean so fresh then you can just put your oil on top that's what i do i use it like after i'm running and and cycling this is the product or after i've gone for like a messy i don't know some of the cycling trips are a bit messy or rather dirty so this is when i'm not ready to wash my hair this is it but yeah I use it alongside washing your hair because you must wash your hair if you train if you train hard or rather as hard as we do you need to so there's this one okay maybe okay, but very little yeah I love this Mikala um leave-in treatment cycling and swimming and running has made me um appreciate living 
Living is so good because you just put it in your hand, you let it stay. Because I really don't like the hassle of washing and then putting treatment and then going back to wash again. And by the time I'm leaving the bathroom, I've showered, I've done everything so that I'm just outside. When I'm out, I'm out. I don't want to come back for anything. So when it's in my hair, I can be doing my skincare and everything. And I just, you know, put it in notes or whatever. I'm actually transitioning from relaxed hair to natural and it's such a hassle so i'm really appreciating this product i hope i'll be able to grow with um to find brands that work for me if you have any suggestions of brands that could work or yeah they work please put them down below they might just end up in my next um current favorites this is one of my oh this one is spritz essentials this is avocado oil and it has the peppermint it feels so nice and fresh as in and then because of the application it's amazing oh, my, my hair just feels so amazing like i love it when my hair is feeling really cool so one of my favorite products let me just get it or one of my favorite um brands i'm actually currently working with them so please place your orders they have this one is even an older model i got this way back but recently is when we started going back to school physically and let me tell you this thing is my everything this tote bag does it for me because it's big enough to carry everything inclusive my car lunch my lunch box my water as in i really really love it and it carries my laptop with so much grace and it fits inside and i just i'm obsessed they have really improved the designs currently so you could go and check Kamandora designs um another Kamandora product that i love is this this is this is top tier i'm a waist bags girl i've always loved waist, waist bags for quick errands and whatnot they have several designs of this you can also check my instagram i have um done videos with this as well with this and other designs you can get them i think they go for 1500 this one goes i think 1800 or 2 g's but you can just check um kamandora designs they also have this one is accessory designs then there's accessories is like hats and whatnot and um i love it i'm obsessed um yeah so the final product of today is this boss planner this boss planner i got it from um a girl called whitney she has worked on this planner i have seen how work and improve this planner from 2019 i think i've been buying planners from her all through the years i think i even have a number i was looking recently and i think oh my god yes i do oh my god yes i think this is it oh my goodness this is it yes it's this one and this one oh my god where's the other one there's this one also. Oh my god. I have all of all the versions. <gasps> ah, I have all the versions. I have them all. So this is the first one that I got in 2019. 2019. <clears throat> 2020. I think. 2020. Then she improved it to this in 2021. Yes. So the 2021 version is very similar to what we are having now. It's just the... Yeah, this one. And then the 2022 is this one. And then 2023. We are here. So she has really, it has really, oh my God, I love it. I lo I, I, Whitney would scream knowing I have all the, all this year's worth of um, planners from her. I love the planners because they help me with Okay. I had the tingling. I love the planner because it really helps me with um, planning my days. I feel like I'm one, not I feel like I know I am one who easily forgets stuff. I could completely forget about like something. I really forget. So having a planner really works for me. This planner, why this planner? Because this planner helps me set my goals. Like, I have a vision board for the whole year, but this planner helps me do quarterly goals. Monthly goals helps me keep in check what I've earned this month, what, have, what are my debts, how much have I paid this month, how much am I remaining with, 
what else am I accumulating? Am I investing? What is the return on investment on my investments? And I think this is insane. I love it. I'm obsessed. Um, I should get better at using my planners. Don't use them every day, but I'm using them much more than I have in the previous years. And it's really doing the work for me. It really is. And I love the cover because hi chappy. It doesn't like get spoiled. So yeah, and just helps me stay um consistent with the habits that I want to um what do you do with habits? You want to have better good habits. Yeah, habits that I want to have encourage um, habits I'm encouraging in my life that I believe will lead to success. It really does that. It also helps me do monthly reviews, helps me set quarterly goals. And she has like all these lessons and as in Whitney has really done the work with this one. So yeah, this is um those are the favorites I've had. I haven't read much. I was hoping to have a book this time, but I haven't really read a book this year. I was reading the year of years and I've read it from CG last year. But I'm saying I'm almost done, so I hope to finish. I also don't have many um mom stuff because Diana is going through a growth spurt, so we are adjusting. Anyway, so as I was saying, um yeah, we're going through a growth spurt and it's we're just figuring that stage out. But now they're on holiday and I have three weeks with them. So I'm trying to see what fun stuff I can put them into so that I can keep them off the screens for a minute. So if you've liked this video, thank you so much for tuning in. Don't forget to like, comment, share and subscribe to my channel if you haven't. And please go get some Samantha wines. It's, it's really sweet. It's a very sweet wine. So yeah, thanks so much for being here. Catch you on the next video. And don't forget to use your sunscreen and hydrate. Bye.